Hey, what's going on, everybody? What's going on? Mic check one, two, one, two. Man, had a few uh, complications trying to pull up what I was going to talk about tonight, but I'm ready to get right down into it, man. And without any further ado, I'm not going to wait another surprise. Points blank travel live stream going on on this Friday night. Glad to see everyone here. Glad to have a. Uh, five people in the crib, one person ringing the doorbell. And as you come in, make sure you ring that doorbell. And that doorbell is a light button. Without any further ado, let's jump right down into it. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? You got your boy back in the crib for another live stream. And I tell you, I got a great, uh, outstanding, and I mean an outstanding topic tonight. And talking about who qualifies for business credit cards. I want to sit back i want to look at it i want to see you know you may qualify for a business credit card and not even know it i was gonna actually uh say this live stream for sunday uh i sent out a a message today to my points blank travel group on facebook and said hey i wanted to finish this month out strong so i thought i'd go ahead and come out with a live stream tonight probably gonna do another live stream sunday there will be a members only live stream sunday uh i, I was gonna do it tonight Really don't see that happening because uh, I did work today and I have to work again tomorrow, uh, my regular job. But there will be a members only live stream Sunday time yet to be determined. It'll probably be in the evening around 730, 8 o'clock where I will. I will walk through how to complete a business credit card application. I'm going to show you examples from American Express uh chase and i'm there may be one other one i'm also tonight i'm going to be talking about the business credit cards that i have in my arsenal but i really want to clear up a couple of myths tonight hey i see we got four people in the crib i know i came on a little later and again man make sure make sure and i need to just go ahead and introduce myself hey welcome to points blank travel everyone the hottest live stream on youtube my name is rod and on this channel we talk about credit we talk about credit cards we talk about points miles cash back personal finance and how to travel around the world or around the country for little or no money out of your pocket if that's something you're interested in do me a favor if you haven't already done so subscribe to the channel Get a video a thumbs up and in my live streams i call it the doorbell make sure you hit that like button smash that like button share the channel with your family and friends share it on your social media platforms and with all that being said one more thing i need to say i can guarantee you if you're not a points blank travel channel member i would highly recommend doing doing so if i'm not mistaken i started working on this live stream probably about two hours ago i posted a, a, a comment early and once i get down to the comments i'll see it also if you're looking for a great way to support the channel super chat super chats are greatly appreciated that is an excellent way to support the channel and with all that being said you know what time it is it's friday night your boy is hype i don't care if i work tomorrow i don't care if i gotta work today let's roll baby matter of fact i'm rocking the let's roll baby tonight you know what i will matter of fact i might be coming up out of it because it's once i turn all the you know i was feeling good i'm like man it's kind of chilly in here but once i threw this hoodie on i'm like hey man it's kind of i'm getting kind of warm because i got all these lights on me Cameras in front of me. I'm hyped up. I'm excited. Let me give me a sip of water in the in the in the new PBT mug. Oh man, it is just good to be here. I got my iPad here because when I do a live stream and I'm going over a particular topic, I do want to uh, make sure I don't leave out anything. Before I go any further, this live stream is being sponsored by Ecam Live. That is a software that I use to do my live streams and I can tell you this the easiest software out there so if you're looking at starting a YouTube channel and you're looking at going live I would highly recommend Ecamm Live there is a link down in the description it is free I pay a subscription for it but I can tell you it's well worth it you know what I want to do right now and, and again I, I have several notes here I have my iPad here so you're going to see me looking down because I want to make sure everyone get this and once I'm done I'm going to jump down in the comments I just see, matter of fact, a cake. I just saw Cakeology, the size of success. Bill B, the best of the best, jump in the live stream. A cake, man, if you could do me a favor, please hang around because I am talking about business credit cards and Cakeology is the master of business credit. And I want him to clear up anything that I may miss because kind of what I'm going to be talking about with business credit cards is sole proprietorships and Cakeology may be able to chime in on EINs and, and, and when you're running a regular business. 
But what I wanted to talk about, a lot of people see business credit cards, and even in my Facebook group, I'm kind of afraid to post about it. I kind of shy away from it because typically people think that you need this mega gazillion dollar business to have a business credit card, and that's not the case. I'm telling you right now, I have, I'm, that's what, five of them, and I don't even know if I got them all. That's five business credit cards that I have in my arsenal that I'm going to go over here in a minute and, and tell everyone how I roll with these. But what I wanted to do, there are several myths out there, and I wanted to clear up these myths. I wanted to talk to everybody about them. I'm trying to position my stuff here because I got all kind of stuff going on here. Uh, hold up, man. I just moved everything. Uh, but I wanted to clear up some of the myths about business credit cards and how to get one, or if you have a large scale business, everybody think, you know, I can't get one. I need a large scale business. I need a multi million dollar business just to qualify for a business card. And that's not necessarily the case. You know, qualifying for a business card may be easier than you realize. One of the things I want to ask, do you have a side gig? You know, a lot of people these days, they say side hustle. I could tell you every one of my business cards right now, they're registered under one of two names, either my personal name or points blank travel. But even the ones that have my personal name, they're still registered under points blank travel. For some reason, they messed up the card and I get pissed about it because I see my name on there twice. But <clears throat> excuse me, a lot of people think that you have to be officially registered with your state or government agency or the IRS to get a business credit card. And that's not the case. And I kind of want K College, I hope he's still in here. I want him to chime in if he's still in here later. I wish this was a uh, a, co a collaboration where we could talk about both aspects, doing it as a sole proprietor, which is how I did it, and doing it from a business aspect. But if you have a side hustle, let's just say a YouTube channel, uh, you, you sell on eBay, you have a daycare, you're an Uber or Lyft driver. If you have any type of business, as long as you're generating some type of for-profit income, and there's going to, and I'm, I'm going to go ahead and give everybody a little hint of what I'm going to talk about in the members only live stream. Every business credit card that I've applied for, they don't ask how much money, right? How much money are you making? They ask how much money are you projecting to make? And I was very conservative. I'm going to be honest with you. When I applied for my business credit cards, I said somewhere between five and $10,000 in the first year. And I have substantial credit limits. I even have my, my business gold card doesn't even have a limit, so they say. It does. It's really how much I can pay back the following month. But as long as you're operating a for-profit venture in case the bank want to do a financial review, you may qualify for a business credit card. Now, and I kind of just mentioned it, and I'm looking at some notes here. The good news is most banks, they don't have a minimum profit requirement when you get a business credit card they don't have a minimum income requirement you know let's say as long as you're eligible to apply for a business credit card even if you don't make deposits for your business at that bank that issues the card and i can tell you right now uh only out of all four of these i only deposit i'm five of these i only deposit money into one of these and not really even from a business aspect i deposit the money from a cash rewards aspect all of my money is deposited into a, a, so, a totally separate account that I don't even have a credit card with. So that's something that I want people to make sure you understand. Again, if you want to see, and I, I hope, I know K College is a platinum member with uh, Points Blank Travel. I hope he's in the live stream uh, Sunday because I'm going to walk through an application. And if he's there, I want him to explain how you may walk through it. I wish, and we may do a collaboration in the future. Hopefully we can, Kate. But I want to explain how I do it as a sole proprietor, but then I want maybe Cakeology to give a hint. Now, speaking of Cakeology, he does do free 15-minute consultations where you can talk to him on the phone and he'll get your business up and running. Before I go any further, I see we got 15 people in the crib, nine people ring the doorbell. And what we're talking about tonight is who qualifies for business credit cards? How did your boy get five credit business credit cards and i'm running a youtube channel matter of fact i will tell you guys right now straight up when i applied for each of these five credit cards i hadn't made any money with points blank travel i wasn't charging anything i'm doing everything from the bottom of my heart now i'm, I'm monetized on youtube so now everything that i stated is going to it's going to come into fruition but at the time it did it hadn't so i want to make sure i didn't miss anything here uh now when you apply as a sole proprietor 
you're not going to have a business EIN or employee identification number. You're going to use your social security number. Keep in mind, your credit, they're going to use your personal credit. So you can't roll in there with a 500 or 480 credit score, <coughs> excuse me, thinking you're about to get some of the biggest and best business credit cards out there because they're still going to look at your credit worthiness. When I was applying for mine, I was, I'll tell you guys right now, I was well over 700, somewhere between 7 50 740 and above i'm not saying you need a 740 750 credit score matter of fact i'm gonna tell you what i think are the not the easiest but some of the best business credit cards to get as a sole proprietor but i kind of wanted to talk about this because there's so many myths out there that you have to have this big business you have to have you know llc's and 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 and, and corporations and all this is best to do it that way and i will tell you the flip side of that i will tell everybody the flip side of that right now i am absolutely not getting any credit for having these credit cards it's not reporting to my personal credit that's another advantage and i'm going to go into a story in a minute of why i apply for these but it's also not giving me any business credit and that's where a guy like cakeology can come into play to tell you how to take these business cards and increase and improve your business credit profile your business credit scores right now in all actuality having these five cards i'm really not getting a credit advantage from it but when i apply i apply for four out of the five in april of may of 2020 reason being is I was wanting to get under 524 so I can get a Chase Freedom or Freedom Flex card. At the time, they didn't, I didn't know the Freedom Flex existed. No one knew it existed. I wanted a Chase Freedom card. So I couldn't apply for a personal card, but I knew there were other cards out there I could take advantage of. So what I did was, if you apply for business credit cards, a lot of the major issuers, American Express, Chase, Chase is who I had a laser focus on, they don't count business cards towards the 524. So each time I was applying for a business card and getting approved, it didn't show my personal credit. It didn't show up to Chase that I had applied for a new car. So on one hand, on the left hand, I'm winning because it's not showing up on my personal profile. But on the right hand, I'm not really getting any credit for having these cards. Me personally, I don't need any credit. I got 27 cards in my arsenal. I have enough credit cards and I'm rolling. I just checked yesterday. Your boy was a little crushed. I ain't go. That was a crush, man. I'm mean, let me quit lying. I was bothered, but my credit score is 792. My FICO, I just checked yesterday, 792. I've been scared to check the last three months because I've been doing a lot of moving, a lot of shaking. So there you have it, man. If you are looking at business credit cards, if you have a saga, do, do you do you do anything that you're making money on that you can prove? And again, it's projected money. If you just starting a business and you think you're going to make this amount of money in the next year, it's pretty. Now, don't make up some hundred thousand dollars or fifty thousand dollars. I said five thousand and on some applications and I said ten on others. And I could tell you right now, points blank travel is going to exceed ten thousand dollars in 2021. Did we exceed ten thousand dollars in 2020 when I applied for these cars? No, we didn't. But in 2021, but I was, I'm using these cars, I'm paying them off, I'm using them, I'm paying them off, I'm using them, I'm paying them off. But I wasn't going, but listen, I wasn't out here going buying 70 inch screen TVs and, and trying to get a card all that with a business credit card. I was keeping it very simple, making minute or small business purchases, gas, business lunches, business meetings, um, uh, cameras, stuff for points blank travel, lights. I was buying stuff like that. These airplanes that you see, I put the globes that you see, I put all that on a business card. But I wasn't going crazy. Now that we're in a profit situation, now that we're in a profit situation, I can make bigger purchases. And I am going to talk about other business cards that I'm looking at getting. Uh, we've been going, what, 14 minutes? I don't like talking too long here. Let me just pull up where I am here. All right, what I want to do right now is I want to go over the business credit cards that I have. I need to put them in the order that I have them in. Um, listed on my little screen here. So y'all just bear with me. There we go. All right. Again, I said earlier that I think the best, I don't want to say the easiest because none of them are easy. You still have to have a credit profile. If I had a choice, I would go for the Chase 
business credit cards first. I'm going to talk about them later because I don't have a Chase business credit card in my arsenal. By the time I found out about it, I was deep in the game. And that's one of the goals for 2021. But if I was starting out right now and I had to have a business credit card and I had a side hustle and I had a side gig, the first business card I would look at is the American Express Blue Business Plus card. This card has no annual fee, no annual fee. I think I got, but it, it was deep in the game. I got like a three, four, five thousand dollar limit. I want to say a three thousand. I don't want to sound like I'm all that. I think I have a three thousand dollar limit on that card. But what I love about that card is I earn two membership reward points for every dollar spent on all purchases, any business purchase, and. A lot of times people think that, okay, I, I have to show that I'm doing this for the business. If I get gas and I'm going to have a business, meaning I'm getting gas as a business uh, uh, expense, I'm putting it on that card. I can tell you, but before, I would highly recommend looking at the American Express tra uh, portal or, or website to see if you qualify or if you're pre-approved for this card. Again, I'm going to walk through on how to complete a chase business credit card application and i'm going to walk through on how to complete american express credit card application business credit card application on sunday for a members only live stream it won't be a regular live stream and i'm i see these comments jumping up and down i'm going to shoot down in here that's number one number two and this is not the order that i apply for these cards i'm just kind of going in an order i also have the american express i want to make sure the light's right man it's kind of hard. I, I need to move back to my regular set. The American Express Business Gold Card. Uh, let me. I don't know if y'all can see it. This card here actually has points blank travel. I don't know if y'all can see that. It has my name and then it has points blank travel at the bottom. My business gold has my name on it twice. I don't know why they did it. Like I know why. I talked to a rep when I got the Blue Business Plus and I did it online when I did the American Express. I was so nervous when I did the Blue Business Plus. I actually called in the American Express and applied for that card. Now, with the business goal, that annual fee on that one is pretty steep. It's $295 a year. You will receive four times the points on the categories that you use the most. I use it for gas. I have it set for gas. I want to say internet's a choice. I also have it set for restaurants. If I have a business lunch, a business dinner, I'll use the American Express business goal because I also have the American Express personal goal that earns four times the points. Hey, I see we got 17 people in the crib. 11 people ring the doorbell. I can understand you coming into the crib and ringing the doorbell is that like button down below. But before you depart or as you depart, make sure you hit the like button. It really helped the video get or the, you, the, the live stream get pushed out to even more people. Next on the list, and I would say, uh, and, and let me actually back up. Before I got these two cards, the business uh, go in the Blue Business Plus. I did establish personal card relationships with American Express before I applied for these two. Next card that I have in my business card arsenal is the Bank of America Business Cash Rewards card. I also have the Personal Cash Rewards card. I've done several videos. It's in my wallet every month. I have the business version at work as well. I established a relationship with Bank of America. This card also has no annual fee. You have up to six categories, six categories where you can get 3% cash back. Mine is currently set to gas. Kind of redundant because I get four times the points on gas with the business, American Express Business Gold. And I get 3% cash back on the Bank of America Business Cash Rewards. But it sounds redundant, but listen to what I'm saying. One's earning points, one's earning cash back. Double dipping. I always believe in having options. And I want to shoot through this. we got 18 people in the crib. 14 people rang the doorbell. Again, the next card, I established a personal relationship with this bank. I have the City Advantage Personal uh, Platinum Select MasterCard. But then I also applied for the City Business Advantage Platinum Select MasterCard. If you look at it, I don't know if you guys can see it. It has my name at the bottom. It also has Points Blank Travel. It falls under the Points Blank Travel umbrella. I typically use this card. Oh, man, my little iPad died. I typically use that card. Just to give you the options that I have, it does have a $99 annual fee. I earn two American Airlines Advantage miles for every dollar spent on uh, cable, communications, and at gas stations. I also would use that at gas stations depending on whether I want to accumulate American Airlines miles. And I get two times the miles for every dollar spent with American Airlines when I fly. I normally use my personal American Airlines card when I fly American 
unless it's a business trip and then I will use that card now. Next, I also have, this is the last card and I do wanna jump down in these comments. I do have the Barclays Aviator Business Advantage card for American Airlines. This card here also has a $99 annual fee. Again, I was trying to build up my business card portfolio. Uh, I will earn two times the miles for every dollar spent at uh, telecommunications and office supply. I normally will pay my uh, my uh, cable bill or my cell phone bill with it uh, sporadically, not every month. It just really depends on what I got going on. Now, other cars that I'm interested in, I'm gonna go ahead and close this iPad because this is the last thing I have to say about that. Other cars that I'm interested in, uh, I don't want to throw it away over there. I might need it again. Other cars that I'm interested in business cards are the Chase Business uh, cards, the Ink Business cards. I am interested in the Ink Business Preferred card, and I'm also interested in the Ink Business Cash card. Hey, I said we got 19 people in the crib. I am going to jump down into these comments. But, man, if you have a side hustle or a side gig, I like to call it a side hustle. I mean, who say? I, I don't know. People may say side gig. I really don't. But, uh. If you have a side hustle or a side gig, I would highly recommend if you have your credit score over 680, uh, Chase right now is a little finicky. I applied for the Chase Inc. Cash Card in 2020, and I want to say I was denied. They never sent me a denial letter, but I never received a card either, so I took it as being denied. Uh, but... I would look at American Express or I would look at Bank of America, the business cash rewards, but I'm not saying you have to do it the way I did it. I did establish a personal car relationship with um, pretty much each bank, except yeah, even Barclays. I have a personal car with Barclays. I have uh, uh, two personal city cars. I have two personal Bank of America cars and several American Express cars. But there you have it, man. Hey, I see we got 19 people in the crib. 16 people ring the doorbell. I am going to jump down. And if you have any questions that I didn't cover about these business cards, I'm not sure how many comments we have here. Uh, I don't have to be on here all night. I have been talking 22 minutes, but I thought this was very, very important uh, because I have a lot of people ask me quite often, how do you get a business card? And again, Sunday, Sunday, probably around between 7 and 8 Central Standard Time, and I will publish it a uh, notification well in advance i will be doing a members only a members only live stream on how to apply and actually i'm not going to apply for a business card i'm just going to walk through it like i did in the last members only live stream unless i decide i want to apply for a new business card between now and sunday which i highly doubt all right hey super chats are an excellent way to support man i always leave a, something out when i say this the chat are greatly appreciated cash shop is points uh, dollar sign points blank Man, I got to slow down. I do that in such a hurry. Y'all should see when I'm preparing for these. All right. Happy Friday, everyone. Join the Points Blank Travel Membership to get access to exclusive perks. If you're interested in joining the membership and checking out this member-only live stream that I'll be doing Sunday and future member-only live streams. And when I do these member-only live streams, they're going to be nuggets. They're going to be not nuggets. They're going to be boulders. They're going to be gems. I mean, if you're thinking about popcorn chicken or chicken and, and, and chicken nuggets now it's gonna be a big breast it's gonna be a breast of information and i'm as y'all can see man a lot of times i feel good all right ulysses we got a channel member in the house we have ulysses in the crib he says welcome back waiting for the good and i'm assuming he's saying good info good knowledge good energy good man i don't know what the good is but hey ulysses i'm gonna finish it off for you my man all right. Good to see you again, Ulysses. It's always great to have you in the house. We have, uh, I always think I'm going to mess this name up, Azuri Wing in the house. It says, great topic. Yes, I I'm glad you thought so. Again, if you have any questions, man, we did a Q&A. Uh, man, was that Wednesday? Yeah, Wednesday I just did a Q&A, a live stream Q&A, and it was great. It went an hour and 16 minutes. And I was shocked at all the uh, questions that I had. And I want to thank again, I want to thank uh, Key, Key Perry for being in that live stream. And she had some great questions. She actually joined my Facebook group and I sent out a, I, I usually send a message out to the Facebook group every Sunday to the new members. I sent one out today because your boy is going to be extre extremely busy. Uh, I'm doing probably another live stream Sunday. I'm doing a members only live stream Sunday. Um, plan on shooting two videos Sunday and I'm probably gonna edit and upload a video either 
to Night Pilot tonight, probably tomorrow, maybe Sunday. So I might upload two videos and a live stream Sunday and do a members only live stream. It's going to be busy. I want to finish the month out strong. Marcus, I don't know where you are. Mar hey, Marcus, who are you? You say good afternoon. Marcus, where are you, man? Let me know where, what area you in. You might be overseas. He says, good afternoon, credit family. And Rod, I hope you good. I hope you have a good day. Yes, man, I, I am. If I, I worked about nine and a half hours a day, came in here, um, took care of some stuff, took a shower, freshened up a little bit, checked the content, read over it a little bit, and, and here I am right now. So, yeah, man, I am having a great day. Uh, Marcus says, is there a member uh, only live stream tonight? No, Marcus, it will be Sunday. Sunday, uh, probably, I'm going to say between 7.30 and 8.45 because if I decide to do a regular live stream Sunday, the members only live stream will be right after that. Uh, so no, uh, there will not be a members only live stream tonight. Unless we get enough people in here, and I just might get froggy, man. I don't know. I, I don't want to make no promises. So if we get enough people here tonight, enough interaction, enough members in here tonight. And Marcus, by the way, is a channel member. Uh, matter of fact, let me jot that down here, man. Boy, if I get a thousand members, I'm going to be in trouble. I'm going to be in trouble. Bear with me, y'all. I got my pen tonight. All right. That's something stabbing me in the back over here. I don't know what it is. I think I forgot to take the tag or the, something out this sweat out of this hoodie. All right, Marcus. Uh, so that it is. And Azir say, is this for 930 Central Standard Time? No. Uh, if you're talking about the members on the live stream, it will be. Uh, wait, is this for 930 Central? Hey, Azir, let me know what you're talking about. Uh, because I don't know if you if live stream, I rarely would do anything at 930. I mean, I have, I'll shoot a video at 930, but live streams and all of that, bro, I don't think I've gone that late. Hold up, man. I got too much going on here. There we go. All right. Hey, we got Sean in the crib, Sean is uh says hi rod and pbt family hope all is well i just applied for my next credit card though my bank now i need to wait for eight to ten days before i know if it was approved hey sean what credit card was that and only reason i'm asking because certain companies if they say seven eight to ten days it's a reason they say that let me know what credit card you just applied for i'm, I'm very curious uh glad to have you in another live stream by the way Hey, we got Neo in the crib. Hey, go, how's it going, Neo? Neo is a channel member as well. Uh, glad to have you in for another live stream. Hey, by the way, if I don't mention you as a channel member, please let me know. The software that I use, I can't see the icons. And matter of fact, I said I was going to do that. Uh, I don't want to hear the echo. I got to practice with that. I don't know how because I have to do it live. But Neo is a is a great, great help on my uh, Points Plane Travel Facebook, uh, in my Facebook group. So I really appreciate uh, Neo being in the crib. Neo says, I'm off work today. Glad you're off work, Neo. Glad you were able to jump in and catch a live stream. It is always a pleasure to see you here. Hey, we have uh, Shirley Lemiro in the house, man. Shirley has been rocking, been rocking ever since she... Uh, checked out her first live stream ever since she became a, uh, 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 let me make sure I got to look at some, ever since she subscribed to the channel, Shirley has been in every live stream representing that Florida, that, that down there in, uh, Clearwater. Glad to see you here. Glad to have you in for another live stream. She says, good evening. Good evening to you, ma'am. It is a pleasure. Hey, we got Cakeology, the science of success, the best of the best, the biggest YouTube influencer in the business game, in the business credit game. He's been uploading a video for every day, probably for the last couple of weeks now. I was trying to keep up with him. I was doing a good job for the first five days, and then your boy took off. He put that nitrous, he put that nitrous in the ride and just blasted off on your boy. He says, PBT the man, and no, cake you the man. And it's funny, man. Um, I don't see it as much now, but I used to see PB quite a bit, depending on who's in here. And Cakeology actually was the first person that called me PB. He would never say the PBT. He's kind of like me. I don't like saying a lot, nothing too long. And a matter of fact, I call him Cake. I'm only saying Cakeology right now is because I want to make sure everyone 
know the exact channel to uh to go to to subscribe to his channel definitely check him out cakeology is also a channel member of the points blank travel youtube channel and it is a pleasure a true pleasure hopefully he's still in the building i know he's very busy he's actually more busy than i am so he'll jump in say what's up and he'll jump out hey we got my baby in the house we got miss pular says i'm here miss pular is also a channel member and uh the vp of operations for points blank travel and also my, my 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 right hand so it is a pleasure to see her i actually just talked to her a few minutes ago when she was working so i don't know how she pulled this off i don't know how she's here and, and was just not here so it's good to see her in the building <clears throat> Okay, Sean says, hey, at Poulard. Hey, at Miss Poulard. Okay, glad to. And, and by the way, if this is your first time here, I didn't say it, man. It's so much stuff that I say in live streams. A lot more than I say in videos. If this is your first time in a Points Point Travel live stream, do me a favor. Let me know what area you represent. I am broadcasting from the DFW, Texas area. That is Dallas, Fort Worth. Right on the border of Arlington and Mansfield. About 15 minutes from AT&T Stadium. Home of the Dallas Cowboys. So let me know what area you represent. You know, if you don't, you don't have to say the t city or the town. I grew up in a small town and I know what it's like. If you don't want to say the state, you can say East Coast, West Coast, Dirty South. You know, I think about that Nelly song, you know. But anyway, just let me know what area you represent. We got 21 people in the crib, 18 people ring the doorbell. As you come into the crib, make sure you do me a favor, ring the doorbell. And that is the like button down below. I'm going to say it again because I'm really making a big push. Share the channel. Share points when I travel with your family and friends. I can guarantee you I'm going to talk about something that everybody can benefit from. Share the channel with your family and friends. I'm just warming up. I've set some goals for 2021. Your boy's trying to hit, you know, I'm at what, 1,404 or five, 1,404 subscribers as of today. I could have said 5,000. My nephew said, hey, Uncle Rod, how many are you going to? What's your next goal? Is it 5,000? That's enough, Josh. It's 25,000, man. I, don't, I shoot for the moon, baby. If I don't make it, I'll be a monster star. Monster stars will be at five or 10,000, but I'm shooting for 25. 30 would be even better. How many views do I want? I think I'm sitting at right at the cusp of 64,000. At a minimum, I want 250,000 by the end of the year. At a minimum. If I hit 100,000, which I'm going to exceed that. I don't care if I got to shoot a video every hour. I'm going to exceed that. But set goals, man. And that's why I kind of wanted to talk about these business credit cards because there's people out there that have legitimate businesses that are probably making way more money than I'm making from a business aspect. Yet, they don't even know they can apply for a business credit card. If you're thinking about applying for a business credit card at no charge, won't cost you a dollar. Hit me up at Points Blank Travel. I'm going to put the email down in the description. Let me jump in the comments rather than not in the description. Hit me up. We'll link up somehow and I'll walk you through it. I can't guarantee you the approval because I'm not the bank. I'm not the one lending the money. But I, I will walk you through it. And it, it won't cost you a dollar. It won't cost a cent. It'll just cost you a little bit of your time and a whole lot of your confidence. Make sure I don't want to, I don't want to go over nobody's head. Let me say that one more time. It's going to cost a little bit of your time and a whole lot of your comf confidence because you got to believe you're going to get approved. Anyway, let me jump back down into this. All right, we got Joe Forth. Hey, Joe, hopefully I was early enough. Joe got on to me Wednesday. He said, man, why so late? I came on at 845 and he was like, hey, Rob, why so late? Because I normally come on at 730, but your boy was exhausted, but I am here and rocking and rolling. He said, in August, I applied for the NFCU. And in case you don't know, you're going to see acronyms on the channel. That is the Navy Federal Credit Union Secure Card. It just graduated to the Cash Rewards Visa. Congratulations, Joe. Congratulations, man. Credit limit. CL is credit limit increased from 200 to 2,000. 10% credit limit increase. Joe, you rolling, baby. Hey, Joe. Joe, you need to get you a hoodie, bro, or a t-shirt. Let's roll, baby. You rolling, Joe. That's what I'm talking about, man. I'm happy for you. Hey, Joe. Joe, keep me straight, man. I, just so y'all know, Joe, keep me straight. Joe, hey, dude, why you late? Why you so late? He didn't say, why are you late? Why are you so late? He let me know I was extremely late on Wednesday. Joe, man, it's a pleasure and it's a blessing to have you here. Sean says, oh, man, okay. I got to go through these little acronyms again. He said, hey, Miss Poolard, good to see you. 
All right, y'all got me the first time with that GTSY, but your boy's ready. Miss Pular says, hi, son, good to see you as well. Hey, it's nothing but love in the PBT live streets, man. It's nothing but love, I, and I love it. You know, I, I think I'm gonna promote Miss Pular from VP to, of operations to president of operations. I'm already, I don't like to say no CEO, I'm just a founder, man. I just founded a company, but Miss Pular brings a lot of energy to points blank travel. Again, she is my right hand, my baby. Whatever you want to call it, however you want to title it, and she brings a lot of energy to the table. So I am so thankful for you. All right, Sean says, "Yep, all is good here at Miss Poulard." All right, Neil says, "Definitely go talk to K College." I did. I am just starting out. Hey, yes, man, I'm telling you, K College is the man when it comes to business credit. He is the man. I'm not sure if he's still in here. I'm actually gonna cake if you are. Uh, I'm gonna reach out to you. I have to work tomorrow to probably 9 p.m. I'm going to reach out to you Sunday, man, in between the recording and all that. I know you've been recording a lot as well. But we need to we need to discuss a couple of things, man. I do have a, a couple of collaboration ideas I'm looking at. And also, we were talking about a mega collaboration. I was actually texting back and forth with uh, the credit card maestro, Walter, today, who's another YouTuber, and also D. Anderson. We, were, we had a three-way text going on uh, pretty much half the day, so... All right. Hey, we got your favorite couple. We got Shelton and Key in the crib. Other YouTubers in the house says, Evening PBT family. What is the best business car for starters? Man, Shelton, I swear you got a camera on my computer. I would say probably, seriously, I, I would probably, if I was going the American Express route, I would go with the Blue Business Plus card or... I was ready for this. Your boy, if you get, if you, if, if hey, it, it was a song came out. I don't want to date myself, but I want to say it was 92, 93. If you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready. And I was already ready for this. So what I'm going to do right now is before I do, let me do something. Let me scroll up because I don't want to. Uh, give me one second, y'all. Let me. Um, now, Shelton and Key did say for starters. But I am going to pull, let me minimize this because I really don't need it here. A lot of the stuff I'm doing behind the scenes, y'all can't see. I'm going to share my screen. What does it say? Deep dive on the best credit cards for business. And according to this article, they say the Chase Inc. business preferred is the best business card. Now, for starters, un unless... I have built some type of credibility or relationship with Chase. I would probably look at the American Express Blue Business Plus. It's it's a, a transferable points card. It's a flexible points card. You're not tied down to an airline. You're not tied down to a hotel. I, once I establish a relationship, if I had to choose, it would be tough. But I would say the Chase Inc. cards, they are beasts, uh, Shelton and Key. They are beasts of credit cards. Let me put me back up here. I didn't plan on spending i just happened to have that still on the screen because i was looking at it earlier so hopefully that answered your questions hey man hey i know you guys are at a thousand subscribers let me know how are you doing on the watch time man i'm telling you live streams is the way to go hey we got 23 people in the crib 20 people ring the doorbell let's keep it rolling neil says chase is offering a 300 dollars business checking bonus right now for new accounts yes they are um now keep in mind when you open the business checking accounts I haven't tried it. Hey, Neo, let me know your experience. Did you were you able to use your social? Did you have to have an EIN? Typically, when you get into the business checking accounts, you will have to have an EIN or uh, employer identification number. I had one some years ago for another business venture I had, um, which I'm actually thinking about starting back. It was a, a investment group that I had. Man, I was like 25 when I started that business, and. Uh, was doing pretty good, but then I was kind of kind of busy and naive and young. So, hey, let me know, uh, Neo. Dion, hey, we got another channel member in the crib. Neon, uh, Neon. Neo just was there. Dion is a platinum member. He says, good evening, PBT fam. Doorbell rung and ready to eat. And in case you didn't know, I haven't said this in a couple of live streams. What Dion means by ready to eat, he's not at a barbecue or a buffet. He's not at first or go to corral. What he mean by he's ready to eat? is I started a slogan in 2021, and I, hey, thank you, Dion, I need to get back to saying that. 
I'm bringing knowledge to the table, but the question is, are you going to grab a plate and eat? That's what Dion means when he said he's ready to eat. So the knowledge is here, but are you going to grab a plate and are you going to eat? I'm not telling you to go out and apply for no business card. I'm not even telling you to go out and apply for no credit cards. That's all on you. I'm just feeding the knowledge. Now, when you go to a, 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 a let's say a, a family gathering or, or a barbecue, you may have ribs, potato salad, barbecue beans, I'm going to keep it simple, and some cornbread. Your boy, I, I just like the barbecue beans, I mean, not the, the, the ribs and the potatoes, I don't care about, and, and the cornbread, I don't care about no beans. So you got to put on your plate what you want to eat, now, or, or some, some hot links. But you may not grab everything, but you're going to grab what you like. So if you don't care about business credit cards, if you don't care about hotel credit cards, if you don't care about airline credit cards, but you care about cashback cards, transferable points cards, American Express cards, you're going to put on your plate what you like to eat. That is the key to all of this. And I try to put some of this in everyday terminology so to make sure uh, I don't lose anyone. All right, Neil says, basically, you should have a 685 FICO and a credit relationship with the bank. Yes, yes, yes. You're not going to roll in. I can tell you right now, you don't need an 800 credit score, but you're not going to roll in on a bank, a business credit card with no 500 credit score and get approved. If you do, uh, man, let me know who you went with because I'm going to go get me one too. Yeah, you're going to have to have, uh, a, I would say a 680. And 680 is what I always say when you're, when you're applying for some of the top tier cards. I have seen articles lately uh, where people are getting approved with 650s and below, but 680 seems to be that sweet spot. I would say if you can, if you can't wait, because I know how it is with applying for cars, if you can't wait, go with it at 680. 680 should be safe, but when you're 700, man, 700 opens up the doors. It opens up the doors for a lot of things. All of these cars that I have here, every one of these, uh, I was over 700 and man, it, it, it was so easy. I was just applying for them and, and, and believe it or not, man, just so y'all know, cause I am human. I'm not some superhero. I'm not some credit superhero, believe it or not. Every time I apply for a car right to this day with a 792 and I just checked my credit score last night, I'm still nervous because I vividly, I vividly remember when I was a 547 and more often than not, I, I received that. We'll notify you in seven to 10 days. And that, not always now, but back then, that meant you, you wasn't being approved or sorry, you were declined. They were a little meaner back then. But each one of these cards, I was over 700 credit scores. So anyway, all right, let's see here. Sean says, okay, it was the BMO Rewards card. Okay, I'm not too familiar with that card, Sean. I apologize, but I tell you what, let me put that in my notes. And I will be looking into it. Uh, let me go to right here. BMO rewards card. And I'll tell you what I think about it. And I'm going to give you my honest opinion. So don't be butthurt if I tell you I don't like it. All right. Hey, we have Tiana in the house. Hey, Tiana, how you doing? Dear, how are you doing? She says, hello, PBT family. In case you don't know, PBT is the Points Bank Travel family. And every time I see something like, what's up, PBT family, man? I feel so good because I look at this as a family. You know, I, I can guarantee you, I was telling Miss Poulard earlier, I, I woke up this morning, I'm like, hey, man, I, I, I got some rest. I'm ready to do a live stream. And this was about 9-ish, uh, 10-ish, something like that. And then your boy had lunch, and I had, oh, I shouldn't be saying it, but I'm going to tell you, I would have had two chili cheese dogs and some tater tots. And 15 minutes after that, I could care less about a lot. So I was like, man, hey, uh, hold up, man, my, my camera doing some tricky. It was focusing on my airplane. Y'all don't see all this stuff, but there's a lot of stuff that I see that controls the light. But anyway, I'm like, hey, uh, Miss Puller, I don't know if I'm doing a live stream tonight. I really don't. Um, man, we'll see. But once I come in here and I think about exactly what Tiana is saying, hello, PBT family. Once I think about the family and I walked into the crib and I saw the lights and, and, and I, I walked by one set to get in the house. I come to the set I'm in now, which is Studio B. You know, I'm trying to sound like NBC or somebody. I, didn't, I don't go to Studio C, which is outside 
because it rained last night. It was a storm. But anyway, I'm like, man, I, I got I to gotta go live. I'm ready to go live. But anyway, all right. Hey, Tiana, it is great to see you in another live stream. Thank you so much for joining. Ulysses says, hey, hold up. Let me take something. No, hey, Tiana, I was thinking you was a, 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 fam, a, a family member. You are a family member, but uh, I was thinking you were a PBT channel member. I know Kiana is. I was thinking you were. Don't go join. I'm just saying. I wanted to make sure I gave you your props if you were. You listen, say, hello, Miss Pular. How you doing tonight? Hey, oh, man, hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. And I hope he's still in here, man. That's why I need to get to these comments a lot quicker. I do have... A legend, a legend in the crib tonight, Philip Reed, and and he's been in for as far as I know, because I only know who's in here. If you come, and I don't, I can't see Phil, and I'm not gonna say Phil. Phil was my mentor in the Navy. Um, I retired as an E8, and if it wasn't for this strong, strong leader, this strong man. I could tell y'all a lot right now. And then we got 21 people in the crib, 22 people ringing the doorbell right now. I really don't care about the doorbell. I just care about how many people in the crib. Because everybody, it's funny how I hear people now saying I'm their mentor. You know, Dion says that quite a bit. Other people tell me that. Other people email me. Phil, not only a, a, a great man, a strong man, but a strong leader. I wouldn't have made it past E5 in the military if it wasn't for Phil. I, I retired as an E8. I can tell you right now, there would be no points blank travel if it wasn't fulfilled. There wouldn't be the very diverse, very energetic, very tuned in, laser focused rod if it wasn't fulfilled. So it is a pleasure, man. And I, you know, uh, hey, Phil, text me, man. If you're still in here, I, because I, I don't want to stop the last time. I say, man, you're still in here. Uh, Hey, okay, hey, uh, Miss Pular, I just got your text. Okay, don't. I, I'll talk to you about that. I'll talk to you about that. Uh, uh, but hey, Phil, if you're still here, do me a matter of fact. I'm gonna text you, man. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta. I apologize because this is like, uh, in my opinion, Phil coming to one of my live streams uh, is like a celebrity. Uh, coming in the live stream because he's a celebrity to me uh and that's again if you if you're if you're if you are a mentor or you think you may be a mentor you never know who's watching you and if you're looking for a mentor man it's always someone and and this man i still look up to so anyway he said hey brother just made another investment in pittsburgh last friday i will send you the link on what i just purchased as always great information tonight man <laughs> Glad to see it. And, and I'm looking at the at the profile pic. Y'all would have never known Phil was in the military. But yeah, man, this man retired as high as you can go in the U.S. Navy at E9. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, Phil, correct me if I'm wrong, if you're still in here, 26 years. I did 20 years in 26 days. Phil did 26 years in the U.S. Navy. Miss Pular says, how you listen? I'm doing well. All right, man. Hey, boy. You know, I got Miss Poulard in here. I got Phil in here. I got Tiana in here. Uh, okay. All right. Hey, Phil, let me know if you're still in the crib, my man. Let me know. Uh, and, and I got to get to the comments, obviously. I just, just got a text. Miss Poulard say you're still in the house. Hey, we got Deshonsky Smith in the crib. Says, what's up, PBT family? Hey, Deshonsky, what's going on, my man? Hey, hey you know, I, uh, I was talking to Miss Poulard. When I come down there, uh, you know, they, I got this little, whatever you call this, this little twisty, curly stuff going on. But I saw this fade that I wanted to get, man. My barber's 68. The dude won't cut my hair the way I want it. And I don't want to get off topic. I know we're talking about business credit cards. But it's two things I won't talk about. That's politics and religion. But it's a whole lot of things I will talk about. So I need to come down there and get one of them, them crawfish fades, man. Get, get one of them boot hand fades. You know what I'm saying? Get it hooked up. Uh... Miss Poulard showed me some cuts you were doing, dude. You're doing phenomenal stuff, man. Keep it up, young brother. Keep pushing. Keep striving. And I, one thing I want to challenge you, man, and I'm not saying next week, next year, next month. It could be three years from now. What I want to challenge you, Deshonsky, and you may already be thinking about it, but if you're not, 
Think about not only how can you own one barbershop, because that's shooting for the stars. And as you check out my video, we shoot for the moon, baby. I want you to think about how can you own two to three barbershops? You working at one, and you got two others making that paper for you. I want you to think about that. And I'm going to hit you back. I'm going to come back. I'm going to circle around back on that. Glad to have you in the building. He says, blessings, man. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Hey, we got Crown Adjusted in the crib. Says, hello, everyone. This is great info. Hey, Crown Adjusted, I'm just going to let you know. If, if, if I even think about doing a video, if I even think about doing a live stream, if the information, if I don't think now, just because I think it's good don't mean it's good. But if I don't have a solid, a solid intuition that everybody, not just Rod, because I can come here and talk about what I want to talk about. But if I don't think everybody can benefit from it, I'm probably not going to talk about it. Uh, oh, man. Hey, Phil, I just got your text, man. I just got your text, and I'm definitely going to check it out. Hey, man, it ain't nothing. Boy, it's positive things going on, man. And I, I'm sorry, y'all. I'll be all over the place. I don't know if I got ADD, ADHD. I don't know, man. I'm just telling you. I got people, my mentor, my, my, my lifetime mentor texted me. He just bought a crib in Pittsburgh. He already got a bad crib down in San Diego. Man, it, it, it's just it's just the, the love that's in the air, man. I, I'm just telling you, as always, man, as always, please, man. As you guys come in here, and it, it's, again, it, it tripped me out every time I said, man, I don't feel like doing no live stream. I'm tired. I can do it tomorrow. I can do it. Then I'm like, oh, I can't do it. Actually, Ms. Poolard said, well, you can do it tomorrow. No, I can't do it tomorrow. I get off at 9 o'clock. I can't. I can do it. I do 11 o'clock live stream. I don't know. Maybe three people in there, but it's three people that's going to learn and get some beneficial info. Uh, I said, no, that means I got to do a Sunday. And I want to do another one Sunday on a whole different topic. So I have to roll with the one. Uh, <laughs> hey, Phil, okay, I got you, man. And hey, I'm going to read this here, Phil, and I'm going to shut up. Phil said, stop it, but I'm just another person trying to help people and make it in this world. Yeah, man, and I'm going to tell y'all, hey, if you're in a position, really, uh, and Crown Adjusted, man, thank you so much. And that's why I'm doing stuff like this. And Phil just said, I'm just another uh, person trying to help people and make it in this world. And if you notice, where did I get my ethics from? Is it ethics? Yeah, it's not ethnics. <laughs> okay, where did I get my ethics from? Where People like Phil. I created Points Blank Travel just because I wanted to help people. I received a, uh, Jay Lewis. He checked out my last live stream, and he had a, I didn't even know this feature was on my Points Blank Travel page. Now, my group was on my page, and we were going back and forth today. And he said, hey, I know you're a busy man. I said, yeah, I am, but I'm never too busy for a question. And I said, I'm here to make sure everybody come up. And um, he kind of faded out after that. I think he made one more comment, and we both kind of went back to what we were doing. But you notice... The apple don't fall far from the tree. Here I am trying to help people. My, the person that mentored me, like a big brother, like a, at times like a father, like a hard father. Phil was one of the hardest people to work for, but he always had great intentions. The apple don't fall far from the tree. Here it is. I want to help people. And he just sent me a text. He want to help people. But, hey, I don't want to get too, too deep on that when I want to jump down in here. Hey, we got Kyron in the crib. Kyron is also uh, uh, in the military, representing the U.S. Air Force. Hopefully, Kyron don't uh, mind me putting it out there. Says, what's going on, man? It ain't nothing going on but the rent, baby. Your boy trying to pay the rent and trying to make sure people get paid. If I could pay the rent, I'm cool, but I want to make sure everybody paying the rent. Glad to see you in another live stream again. Thank you for that super chat you gave a couple of weeks, uh, about a week ago. I'm about to say a couple of weeks ago. Hey, we got Mr. Chocolatazo in the crib, another credit card guru. He doesn't have a YouTube channel, but the man is a guru. He says, good evening, credit card familia. Hey, que paso, amigo? <laughs> hey, I got to get my Espanol on, man. Hey, hey, uh, Mr. Chocolatazo, I saw you uh, like the, the post I put on IG. We hit 1,400 subscribers yesterday, so your boy is ecstatic. All right, Ms. Poolar says that, Kyron, tonight we're discussing business, credit for all your entrepreneurs. More details on the member only live stream on Sunday. As a member of PPT, you qualify for the members only live. Yes, you do. And, Kyron, make sure you get the gold level because silver level I'm only doing for 
February as of now, I'm probably going to extend it to March. That's the lowest level. And but after that, after March, starting April, you won't have access to the exclusive members on the live streams. So definitely make sure you're looking at gold level. Thank you, Ms. Pular, my newly appointed president of operations, not VP. You've been promoted. You have been promoted. Man, hey, LVZD. Let me know. Is that an L or I? Put the big capital. Capital I because I responded to a comment from you uh, yesterday, the day before. And I, it took me 15 minutes to respond to your comment because I couldn't tell whether that was an L or an I. And I put that little at symbol. But let me know. Can you write off annual fees on your taxes for a business credit card? Not that I know of. If you can. And that is a great question for Cakeology, the business credit guru. I know how to get the credit cards, but all the ins and outs and, and the tax benefits and, and ramifications, I'm not that verse on that i'm more of a personal credit guy but i do know about business credit cards but that is a question that i would probably try to schedule a 15-minute consultation with cakeology or reach out to him on his uh uh ig at cakeology he, he he usually responds so i would definitely check him out on that i don't think so though. i've never heard of that in, in that case man no one will be paying annual fees and i can tell you i'm gonna do a video coming up um i don't know when it, it may be 2025 when i do it <laughs> because my annual fees are astronomical i just tonight alone that's 295 so basically 300 dollars. that's 99 that's another hundred that's uh three that's 400 that is that's 500 dollars of annual fees and these are only three business cards out of 27 that i carry my annual fees are probably astronomical but i make sure i exceed the value so uh, I've never heard of that. Hey, Neo says I haven't opened an account yet, but I'm certain you need an EIN. Okay, yeah, yeah. If you if you do a Chase business account, typically if you do a business checking account, you will need an EIN. Uh, my tax preparer, her and I have talked uh, the last two years about doing an LLC, and uh, I know I've talked to Cakeology about getting some business tips from him. And I said 2020, and I lied to myself, and I said 2021. Points Blank Travel was going to become an LLC, but I can tell you right now, I'm not forced, but I, I have such big plans for Points Blank Travel uh, that it is going to become an LLC, or I'm thinking about making an LLC under the parent company and Points Blank Travel just be one of the companies under the big umbrella LLC, and I'm not going to put that name out there yet. Um, it's almost like I'm just not going to put it out there right right now. Um, but I will be um, starting, like I said, I will be starting a second channel. And and I'm looking at a big business umbrella for Points Blank Travel, but will be right underneath the big umbrella. But Points Blank Travel will be it's just like the oldest child. You know, you had that oldest child. And I don't want to get too far off topic because I can't get off topic. Points Blank Travel is always going to be their oldest child that's kind of taking care of all the rest of the siblings. So regardless of what, I do have other business ventures. I have RT Holdings, which is my investment ventures. I have uh, some real estate I'm invested in. So uh, that will fall under that umbrella. And stay tuned. And a matter of fact, I probably will expose that to the members. And I, I will say, because I, I look at uh, Joe Ford just became a new member. Uh, I, I say it, man. Becoming a PBT channel member is like going to Las Vegas. What's said in the channel membership uh, live streams, it stays in the live streams. And I do give a lot more personal information and a lot more plans on what I plan on doing. And I have some big, big things I'm set, setting up to do in 2021. Hey, Joe Ford, thank you so much. Congratulations. Joe Ford just became a new member of the Points Blank Travel channel membership. Joe, you asked about it a couple live streams ago, uh, ago, and I'm like an elephant. I don't forget, and I knew it was just a matter of time. And and Joe, man, Joe, the way he described himself, man, I can and I see. I, I don't see it now, but I, I, Joe's a member of my Points Blank Travel Facebook group, and I see his picture. And Joe's this guy that I just one day I want to meet, man. I just I, I can see there's so much knowledge there. And so much I can learn from. And it ain't got to be about no dang on credit cards or credit. It's knowledge I can learn about life. So, hey, Joe, I really appreciate you. Hey, we got 23 people in the crib. 22 people ringing the doorbell. We got my main man, 
uh, Phil Reed in the crib, one of my mentors. We got K College of the Science Success in the house. We got Ms. Pular, my president of operations in the house. We got so many channel members in the house. We got viewers in the house. We got new viewers, recently subscribers, man. We, it, it's, just, it's just a beautiful thing. And I, and I am ready. Hey, Neo, uh, another uh, channel member and also a huge help on the Points Blank Travel Facebook group says, welcome, Joe. And that's the kind of love we show here at Points Blank Travel. I don't even have to say it. We got no uh, Neo 100 already telling Joe welcome before your boy even get to it. And that's what I'm talking about. Uh okay, Ulysses says PBT I had to I had to check that out. PBT send me an email of all of the secured cards. Uh I will send you a link, Ulysses. Uh I don't know if I have your email. I'll probably text it to you. I know I have your personal number. I, I'll text it to you. I don't know about sending an email, but if I don't email me at points blank travel at gmail.com points with it as points blank travel at gmail.com i'll shoot you that link my man um you don't really need uh, all the security credit cards i'm gonna tell you right now you listen and this is gonna be a side uh topic from what i'm already talking about you want to look at a good security card you look at a discover it secured capital one secure uh it's a couple more u.s bank secure that could be a little tougher to get into you want to look at the bank of america uh, secure cash rewards card, but I'll send you a link with all those listed in there, man. And it's just coming off the top of the dome or the top of the head. Mr. Chocolatazo said, hey, hey, K College, what's good, player? Hey, it's funny. I actually met uh, Mr. Chocolatazo. I, I virtually met him. I haven't met him yet, and I'm, I can't wait. I virtually met him on uh, Travel Explorer Clicks channel. Then I ran into him on K College's channel. It's so good when we see everybody just just gelling man everybody gelling everybody coming in my main man phil says hey i'm still here and i know phil phil ain't gonna be here long so i gotta uh make sure i give him a shout out real quick baby but hey phil thank you for everything you did for me man thank you so much hey crown of justice says thank you both for your service hey no problem and i can tell you man if i could go back and do it again i only have one regret i have one regret about joining the military the only one I wish I would have joined it two years earlier. That's the only regret. I joined at nine. Well, I say one year earlier. I joined at nineteen. I wish I would have joined at eighteen. I won't say seventeen. Um, I was still in high school. I had a ball. It paved the way uh, for me with a lot of things. It paved the way for things I don't even use now. But uh, I was able to get my bachelor's degree. Through the Navy, I met so many people like Phil, so many people, so many people that I'm still in touch with, so, so many people I'm still in contact with. So, Crowd of Justice, thank you so much. It is a pleasure. Oh, Phil, okay, Phil did 24. You feel, I don't know why I thought it was 26. I don't know why I thought it was 26. Phil did 24 years. Man, wow, it seriously it seemed like, it seemed, I don't know why I thought it was 20. I know you were talking about 26. Ms. Poulard says, grateful for your service. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you so much. Thank you. And I'm, I'm saying thank you for Phil. And I, and I, I uh, Ms. Poulard, I can't wait till you meet Phil, man. This, this dude here is one in a million. Hey, we got 25 people in the crib, 22 people ringing the doorbell. Hey, keep in mind, man, if you guys have questions about business credit cards, you know, if it's too deep for me, I'm going to refer you over to K College. Y'all got to excuse me, man. I got this gigantic, uh, some kind of watch on. I normally wear my Rolex which is kind of light, but this one here is a little heavy and it's, it's getting on my nerves. So I'm going <laughs> to, I'm going to let it rest for a while. I'll probably be looking for it tomorrow. I was looking for my, um, oh, I moved it. One of my credit cards and I had it in the last live stream. And I'm like, man, I was at the grocery store. Like, where's this credit card? I probably lost it. And here it was. So, all right. Mr. Chocolatazo says at points blank travel, real man, give credit to others while they are alive. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Much respect to you for giving credit to Mr. at Philip Reed in front of the world. Respect, real one. Yeah, man. You know, uh, hey, Mr. Chocolatazo, you, I think you and I, I don't think, you and I talked quite extensively on the phone. I think you know where I come from, man. We, we kind of talked about that, how people can be funny, keep a, people can be shady. And I tell you, if nothing else, man, and not, if nothing else, and, you know, I can't curse on here, but I'm a real... I'm a real one. <laughs> I won't put the, the letters and the name behind it. I'm a, I'm a real one. And I can tell you right now, you think I'm a real one. Phil Reed is really a real one. 
And uh, yeah, I, I have to give credit. You know, so many, so many people want to look at their accolades and say, you know, I'm self-made or I made this or I created this. No, man, no. I could say that and I can want to believe that, but can I really live with that lie? Because that's what it would be. No, no. Everything that I've accumulated, and I, I, I met Phil in 19, he going to kill me. He already told me, shut up, but I don't care. He, I don't work for him no more, so I can keep on talking. Uh, I met Phil back in 1995. Uh, matter of fact, there's another good friend of mine, DeJoy, uh, that's out in uh, Sacramento. And every time I talk to him, I just talked to him a couple weeks ago, it goes without Phil. Hey, man, how's Phil doing? What's up with Phil? Have you talked to Phil? Uh, yeah, man, you know, if I have, I have. If I haven't, I haven't. I say, yeah, I have. Or yeah, I talked to him three months ago, four months ago, whatever. And we served together in 94, 95. So we're talking, uh, man, that's da, 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 coming up on 30 years ago. And I still have people asking me how this guy's doing. And four a year, four or five years after we served together, I came up for orders again. It was time for me to go to my next ship, and Phil was on the ship. And I, he, I can't remember if he asked me to come there or if I asked him was it cool to come. There. I can't remember how I went, but man, I, I was over here with him. One of the hardest, I, the two people I've had, the, the hardest two people I've ever worked for, was Bob Clark in the current business I'm in now and Phil Reed back in the military. And both of those people made me successful. So for all you young people out there, if you have a supervisor, if you have a boss and they ride in your ASSS, don't think that they're mean. Don't think they're out to get you. Maybe they're trying to make you better. And that's just a little note from the ROD section. Now, let me get back down into this here. All right, man. Let me jump down in here real quick. Hey, I got the inaugural PBT channel member, the inaugural member, Mr. Maurice Miles in the crib. He says, hey, Rod and PBT, PBT family, blessings to all. Blessings to you, brother. Bless up to you, Maurice. Glad to see you in another live stream. You know, if I'd have, if I'd have stopped this, well, who knows? I don't know. You could have made the comment 30 minutes ago. I've been just talking. It's always good to see you in the live stream, my brother. Hey, Maurice, just so you'll know, man, and to all the members, Mr. Mr. matter of fact, Mr. Chocolatazo is also a family member. I mean, a family member. He's a family member as well. A channel member. Uh, Maurice is a channel member. Make sure, make sure Sunday is probably going to be, it's probably going to be 845 because I'm going to do another live stream Sunday. If some change, look for it between between 7:30 and 7:45. Definitely look for a live stream. Man, I gotta figure out why this my camera's focusing on this airplane. I'm gonna have to move this airplane out the way because y'all don't see it. But there's some little stuff going on on my camera where I'm seeing how it's moving around. But anyway, so Maurice, hopefully I'll see you there, man. I can tell you right now, dude, it's gonna be off the chain. You may or may not need it, but I'm gonna walk through how to apply for a business credit card. I'm not gonna tell you. I can guarantee you get approved, but I'm gonna show you how I do it and. Your boy's sitting here, uh, uh, we won't count the business goal, but this is probably at least $40,000 worth of credit limits, $40,000, $50,000, I don't know, because I, I I, I'm cheap, I'm not spending that much, it don't matter what it is, I'm not spending that much anyway. Mr. Chocolatazo says at IVZD, yes, you can, 100% business credit question, okay, hey, that's why I noticed when I introduced Mr. Chocolatazo, I say he's not a YouTuber, but he is a guru. There are going to be people in the PBT live streams that can answer questions I can't even answer. And your boy ain't too proud to say so. So if you have a question, man, ask, ask. Don't be embarrassed. Don't be a shy. Don't be afraid. Ask the question. Thank you so much, Mr. Chocolatazo, man. You know, you the man. I really appreciate it. If it is a business expense, it is tax deductible. So if you're, well, man, Mr. Chocolatazo, hey, I'm going to raise my hand. I got a question. I need to type my whole question in my whole chat. Hey, so you, hey, Mr. Chocolatazo, you mean to tell me all these gazillion annual fees I have I can write off? I ain't going to even get deep into that, bro. We'll talk about that on the phone. I ain't going to get deep into that on the live stream. We'll talk about it on the, on the phone. Thank you so much, my man. 
Hey, Dion, Dion's still in the crib. Hey, uh, Phil, Dion is also in the Navy, man. Another, another uh, squid, another Navy vet. <coughs> uh, man, Dion, you look so young, dude. I didn't know you were 34, man. Hey, whatever you're doing, dude, I need to subscribe to you because, hey, I need to get my, 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 whatever you call it on. Dion says, Rod, I joined at 19 hours, so now I'm 34 and will be retired at 39. It really, really does go by quick. Yes, sir, it does. Man, Dion, I'm serious, bro. You don't, you don't look no 34, man. Y'all can't see his picture. I mean, Dion, he, he's in my Facebook, uh, group man dude whatever you're doing keep it up man and i will be following this young man because ever since i've uh, virtually met him and i can't wait to actually meet him he's always called me his mentor uh on on youtube and i, and I wish i could have served with him and 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 really been a mentor uh and phil says no thank you brother and, and phil's always humble like that you know i learned a lot from phil man a whole lot well, I tell you what, man, we, uh, we've been going an hour and 10 minutes strong. Um, I do have another battery that's on standby if I need, you know. And again, once again, I didn't even expect to do a live stream. I will. I, and I can tell you, all man, the the the, the, uh, about to say winter, the, the, the spring months are approaching. Uh, I am about to seriously increase production and seriously increase production. I can tell you if I'm not working late, whether I'm off or getting off or working early, and early is me getting off at like 5 30, I'm probably gonna be shooting videos. Either I'm gonna be like I already have a, a video I shot, I just have to edit it. Uh I love these live streams. I love the community. Again, man, do me a favor, you guys. We got 20 people still in the crib. This is a I don't know if you call it a plea. Um a request I don't know exactly what you call it but seriously share the channel with your family and friends there are so many people out there that can benefit from information they may not give a blank about a business credit card they not may not even be care about a credit card but it, I, I'm gonna be talking about topics as we go through 2021 that I know they call them evergreen that people can relate to. I want to talk about uh, opening the right bank accounts or more investing topics, but I don't want to go over anyone's head where they think is is something that's above them. Um, so definitely, uh, hold up. I'm, uh, I'm trying to, I'm, I just saw a thing here. Uh, Ms. Pular said, hey, Dion, thank you for your service as well. And Ms. Pular says, subscribe to Ms. Pular, and I'll get you right. Hey, Ms. Pular, you going to get me right or you got a channel I don't know about? <laughs> but anyway, hey, tell me, you got you to gotta explain that one. Uh, but yeah, man, um, seriously, it, it, it's, it, it's stuff out there. I want to make sure we get this out to as many people as we can. I want to make sure we we push the, the channel out. Um, and also, for the channel members, the viewers, the subscribers, people that are members of the Points Blank Travel uh, Facebook group, if there's topics you want to hear about, all I care about is one person being interested in it. Uh, Doc. I haven't seen Doc in a in a live stream lately i know when i do my videos he'll comment doc gave me a list of videos to do and i'm still i've done a, quite a few of them and i still have some i need to do but um definitely man if you guys have a topic that you're interested in please do me a favor let me know because what i'm thinking about may not be what everyone else is thinking about and if one person is interested I don't I don't care if it's a four minute video or I don't I don't like to make videos too long. I do a long live stream, but videos I don't like to make them too long. But uh, uh, <laughs> I'm tripping. I miss fool art. But if there's a as, if there's a topic y'all want to hear about it, even if it's a short topic, uh, Key Perry, uh, one of the subscribers, asked me on Wednesday, what was the future of the channel? Would I always be talking about credit and credit cards? 
on this channel i'm going to expand a little bit but i am going to be starting a second channel in the spring summer and i want to set a name of it i just don't want anyone to steal the name but it's going to be a wide array of topics and on youtube you have what they call niche a niche i am in the personal finance niche with this channel and i didn't want to take this channel in 17 different directions but i'm gonna i'm gonna roll the dice man i'm gonna roll the dice on the next channel and I'm going to be talking about experiences. I'm going to be talking about life experiences. I'm going to be talking about some of the things I've gone through, how I failed, how I succeeded, how I grew, how I didn't grow, all of that. But uh, I also want to talk about uh, some various topics on this channel. And I, I can get outside of the finance niche, but I want it to be something, if I get outside of the finance niche, I want it to be something that people are interested in. I don't want Rod to get outside of the financial niche. And I just start talking about stuff that I want to talk about. Again, going into the future, man, when y'all see the thumbnail for the live stream, just because I put business credit cards or American Express credit card or Chase credit card, we can talk about whatever y'all want to talk about. Please, man, come in here. I love the people that interact. I love the people that ask questions. And, and, and I love the people that sit back and really don't say anything this live stream. They may not say anything the next live stream. They may wait two, three, four, five live streams down the road and then find a comment. I, I love those people as well because I, I watched, seriously, y'all, seriously, probably seven, 800 videos before I commented on one, and I'm being serious, only because I was too lazy to log in. So... Let me jump in these comments. I do see there. Uh, <laughs> uh, Miss Poulard says you, baby. Okay, thank you, sweetheart. Okay, I got you. I just had to make sure, man. I didn't know maybe you had a YouTube channel. Subscribe. I'm already subscribed to you, so I'm good. I am good. Hey, we got another legend in the house. Another non-YouTuber that should be. Chase King, I'm not going to read it like that. I'm going to read it the way I think it should be said. Chase King says, what's good, my people? Chase King, correct me. I want to say it was 34. It could be 36. He is, uh, his name is not Chase. His name is not King. He is the master of Chase credit cards. Knows quite a bit. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, but I was looking at something else. Uh, he says, what's good, my people, man? It's good to have you in the crib. Chase King always say, hey, what's good, big bro? He'll shoot me a comment or he'll jump on here. So I guess I need to start saying what's good, little bro. But, uh, man, that dude has a wealth of knowledge. I'm not going to say beat him up with questions. Not at all, but definitely check him out. All right. I just saw it. 36. Okay. I don't know why I want to keep you stuck at 34, my man. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm shortchanging you like that. But definitely, man, if y'all have questions, and Mr. Chocolatazo, they, he's been around a while, Chase King, D. Anderson, Credit Card Maestro, uh, Cakeology, Justin Fakula, anybody that come into my live stream, uh, Dwayne from How to Build Credit TV, if y'all have questions, they know they can answer the questions. I don't, they don't have to wait till I get to them. They can answer the questions. I am not offended at, at all. Miss Poole, I said, come on, baby. I know you're not so subscribed to me. I will get you right, okay? Hey, I might be a little slow tonight, baby. I might be a little slow tonight. I don't know. I, oh, man, Miss Poole, I something else. I can't wait to talk to you. I know I'm going to hear about this one. Woo, I'm going to hear about this one. Uh, Mr. Chocolatazo says, yes, you can 100% write off those annual fees. All right. Uh, uh, Mr. Chuck said, Rod on your tax question. Then Chase King says, 36 big rod. And hey, and there go the love I was talking about. Mr. Chocolatazo is showing love because him and Chase King have communicated before. Says, what's good, Chase King? Man, that's what I love about this community. Chase King said, because last time I made a mistake and told you 34 and then corrected and said, that's what's wrong. That Chase King, okay, it's all your fault, bro. It's your fault. I knew it. I knew it wasn't my fault because I think I said 32. And then you said 34. And then I got 34. Then you went to 36. Well, next time I'm going to say 38. Anyway, <laughs> I won't be wrong. Hey, man, but seriously, if y'all have questions, man, <clears throat> Mr. Chocolatazo 
and Chase King, they, you know, they know, I'm not going to sit here and say they know it just as much as I do. They may know more than I do. And again, man, I don't, I don't mind giving people props um, where they're due. So definitely, man, if y'all have questions, man, hit those, hit those, hit those brothers up, man. Hit, hit them up. Hit them up. Hey, yeah, Chase King, it is all your fault, big bro. <laughs> hey, man, I love this dude, man. You know, and uh, I, I was telling Miss Poolar earlier, I was like, man, I need to call my little brother. I need to call this person. I need to call this person. I need... It's like it was a whole list of people I need to call. And uh, Chase King is definitely on that list. Also, I need to holler back at Mr. Chocolatazo. Uh, you know, I don't know if people experience what I experience because I, I feel like I'm great at reading people. Uh, but certain people you talk to, I've talked to Chase King on, I've, I've talked, chatted with him several times in live stream. I talked to him on the phone once and I talked to Mr. Chocolatazo on the phone once. And both of them were pretty lengthy conversations for me to be talking to a dude. Now, I talked to a, a female for a while. I ain't gonna be on the phone with a dude other than even me and my brother. We we talk every two, three, four weeks. I need to call him. And unless we catch it up with sports, man, we might be on the phone, yeah, 15 minutes, 20 minutes. But both of these brothers, I was on the phone with quite a while because I felt a connection, man. I felt a genuine connection of people that supported me and people that I was interested in talking to. And I'm a firm believer, man, surround yourself with great people. You know, I posted to my Facebook group last night. You know, I was starting to get concerned because I posted uh, 14, I hit 1,400 subscribers. I'm like, you know what? And I put it in my notes, man. I don't want to mess this up. Let me make sure I read this properly. Uh, celebrate small wins. Small wins build momentum. And I had to tell myself, because I'm like, dude, 1,400 subscribers, that's nothing. A lot of your boys, uh, Dwayne sitting at 25.6. This one, you know it's crazy. You, you know it down to the point. Credit card maestro, 29 and some change. Those are only two. I haven't looked at Cakes lately. I haven't looked at Anderson's lately. Just saw work to live, not live to work, and I'm going to jump down here in a minute. Just told her the other day, she always called me superstar. She's over 3,500 subscribers. And I said, man, here I am proud and, and, and posting on Instagram and Facebook about having 1,400 subscribers. Maybe I should wait. Maybe I should wait till I get 2,000 subscribers. Maybe I should wait till I get 3,000. And I'm like, no, man. No. Celebrate the small wins because those small wins build momentum. And I want everybody out there to think about that as you go through life, as you go through your credit card journey, as you go through your credit journey, as you go through your life journey, as you go through your employment journey. If they give you a certificate for being that employee that show up every day for 365 days, that's a small win. Small wins build momentum because that could be your path to being promoted. That's why I'm excited about this other channel because what I just said, going to work every day for 365 days and you receive a certificate, that could be, that's a small win, but it could be a small win that will build momentum for you to get promoted. That's not a credit or credit card conversation. That's the next channel I'm about to create conversation. And I guarantee y'all, and that's also a PBT channel membership conversation because I'm going to get away from uh, from uh, I'm sorry I just got another text I'm going to get away from just man this text just messed me I'm get away from just being one one sided so anyway uh, let me jump in here because I'm at a one hour and 23 minutes I am going to go through here and holler at all the rest of the people in here. And I'm going to go ahead and get ready to cut this one. Shout. We've got 20 people still in the crib. Mr. Chocolate House, I'm good, my brother. Hope you're staying well, man. Yeah, I hope both of y'all stay well. I know you are. You both of you guys are great. 
Uh, Miss Pular said 1400 going strong. Yes, ma'am. And we're about to continue to grow. Hey, I do have another YouTuber in the house. Work to live, not live to work. I was actually in her, her live stream probably about 20 minutes before I started mine. Uh, went over there, for, totally forgot, you know, kind of sort of not being selfish, just forgot that Felicia does live streams at 7 30 p.m. Um, Central Standard, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time um, out of uh, New Jersey. Work to live, not live to work. She is an extreme couponer. And her live, her live stream is pretty interesting. I actually stopped watching it at about 8.15. <laughs> and I'm like, hey, dude, you better quit watching her because you're about to go live. She says, hey, Rod and PBT fan, I'm here. I am late and starting a video from the beginning. Thank you so much, Felicia. Hey, that was a very interesting uh, live stream you had going tonight. Um, I'm probably, I'm not probably, I'm going to go back and watch the beginning as well. Uh, and I meant to do a super chat while I was in there. So I had to catch on the next one. Well, hey, everyone, man, I just got a text uh, here. And we got 21 people that are still in the crib. Right now is the time to ask questions because I know this camera. It used to be a two-hour uh, life on the battery. Now it's about an hour and a half. I've been rolling an hour and 25 minutes. I want to thank everybody that came into the live stream tonight. Thank you for the continued support. Thank you for Joe Forth for becoming a channel member. I really appreciate it. Again, on the uh, there will be a man. I hit my little light. There will be a members only live stream Sunday. Uh, I'm probably going to do another live stream. Then we'll immediately follow that live stream where I am going to walk through how to complete a business credit card application. I'm going to walk you through and show you exactly how I do it, how I've done it, how I was able to get the, and just walk through them again, the Barclays Business Advantage uh, card, the American Express Business Gold card. I look like my light is off here. The City Business Advantage Platinum Select uh, American Airlines card, the American Express Blue Business Plus card, and the Bank of America Business Cash Rewards card. I am going to show you how I completed applications to get approved for all of those. And it's not really a secret. It's just you have to really kind of sort of pay attention to what you're doing. And I believe, I, I'll be honest with y'all, the first time I did it, I was a little nervous about it. Really didn't know what I was doing. And I don't want anyone to go through what I went through with that. It was a... Uh, 10 or 15 minutes stressful period. Uh, man, I got texts popping up over here all over the place. Ulysses just hit me up. Hey, Ulysses, you're welcome. Uh, again, also, one thing I will be doing uh, for the month. Matter of fact, let's just quit, quit playing. For March is right around the corner. For anyone that's a, a, a PBT channel member for the month of uh, February or March, um, I don't know if I want to put restrictions. I don't really want to put any restrictions. For anyone that's a channel member, and you're you, you're only going to receive it, the only way you're going to receive it is being in the members only live stream. I'm going to be sharing my personal number. I've already I did it last members only live stream. And Mr. Chocolate Tazo really helped me out. He came up and cleaned it up towards the end. He was like, "Hey, make sure if you have a question, man, uh, check out the videos or or Google it." But if it's something that you really need to discuss and you need some advice, if you're a, a channel member in the month, you become a channel member in the month of February and March, I will be putting in the next members on the live stream my personal number out there. I've already done it last live stream. Uh, and I've had channel members reach out to me. I, I hit them right back. And if I don't, it's because I may be in a meeting or I may be shooting a video. So that's going to be an extra perk that's not even listed in the channel memberships. Typically, I would do for platinum members. I mean, you have to be the tip of the iceberg platinum members. I would do a, a Zoom call or a video chat uh, once per month. But for anyone that joined the channel membership in February or March, you will get my personal number and you will have direct access where you can ask any credit, credit card question or anything. Um, so that's an extra perk i'm gonna go ahead and get ready to wrap this live stream up i see we got 16 people in the crib 27 people ring the doorbell do me a favor if you haven't already done so 
subscribe to the channel hit that subscribe button down below i did have a uh, uh, Zuri asked me the other day, she, uh, she's not sure why she's not receiving the notifications. Make sure when you ring that bell for notifications, select all there is. It defaults to personalize and they have none and they have all. Give a video a thumbs up if you didn't do so on the way in. Make sure you're doing so on the way out. Hit that like button, smash that joint. I would really appreciate it. I want to make sure I didn't miss any more comments from the looks of it I didn't. Share the channel with your family and friends. Share it on your, your social media platforms. I would really appreciate it. I'm really trying to grow this channel. And again, as I said earlier, I want to see everybody. I want to see everybody come up. I want to see everybody rise. Neo says, thanks for being accessible. Hey, no problem, Neo. No problem at all, man. You know, I'm not a superstar, bro. I'm and like Phil said, man. I'm just a, a, another man trying to make sure everybody else is good because... I, I just want to be there for people, man. I really want to be there for people. Neo says, good night all, and I got to agree with Neo. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here again. I will be putting out a video between now and Sunday. I will be doing a live stream uh, Sunday. I also will be doing a members only live stream Sunday. I'm going to get ready to get out of here. As always, do me a favor. Shoot for the moon, baby. If you don't make it, you'll be amongst the stars. I'll be coming at you soon, dropping even more knowledge. And until then, hope you have a great day rest of your evening hope you have a great weekend and if you have nothing else i have one thing to say peace baby y'all take it easy i'll see you soon